In exercise 13, we can see a ticket for an aeroplane journey and the travel itinerary. Let's read the ticket closely together and see what information we can learn. We can see that this person has a first class ticket. That means that they have probably paid more money for their ticket, but they should get a better experience on the aeroplane. Usually they get a nicer seat and sometimes they get free food. The cheaper tickets are usually called economy class ticket. Next, we can see here and here that this person is flying to Stockholm. Stockholm is the destination of this flight. The name on the ticket says Edward Douglas, so he will be the passenger on this flight. Here it tells us that the flight is from Vancouver. It will be departing from Vancouver and flying to Stockholm. Here it tells us the boarding date, which means that on this date the flight will happen. And it says that this flight was on the 2nd of November 2017. Next, it says flight and has a flight number. This number will be useful for the passenger once they are at the airport so that they can locate their flight. B25 is the boarding gate and the boarding gate is the place in the airport where the passenger will wait to get onto the plane and board. Finally, it tells us that boarding time is at six o'clock. So at six o'clock, the passenger will have to be at the gate because that is when the passengers will board the flight. At the bottom of his ticket is the boarding pass. Here, it repeats the flight number and that it is a first class flight. It also tells us that his seat number is 014L. Once the passenger is on the plane, he will need to look for this seat. Once again, it repeats that this flight happened on November the 2nd, 2017. Now, let's have a look at his travel itinerary. And now we know that his journey involves two flights. Flight number one says Sunday the 2nd of November and also has the flight number AA100. We already saw on the ticket that this was flight AA100 and that this flight happens on the 2nd of November. So we know that flight number one is talking about the flight that we just spoke about. But now we can learn that he checks in at Canadian Airlines desk. So he is flying with an airline called Canadian Airlines. And now we also learn that his flight left from Terminal X. It repeats that his flight departs from Vancouver at six o'clock, but now we also learn that his flight will arrive at eight o'clock in Stockholm. Now let's look at his details for flight number two. This flight happens on Monday the 3rd of November, so we know it happens the day after the first flight. We can read here that the flight number is BA572. At 7.30, the passenger has to check in at British Airways desk and the passenger is going to fly from Terminal 1. We can also see that the passenger's gate is E14. Below this, it tells us that he is going to depart Stockholm at 9.30 and that he will arrive in Paris at 11.30. At the bottom of the ticket, it just confirms again that his seat has been reserved for this flight and it repeats the date of his second flight. Finally, it tells the passenger how to confirm their next flight if they want to by ringing that phone number.